So why is this not in the the mainstream now? Why are doctors not doing? Why aren't drug companies doing research on these peptides? Uh, I think there are. There were a few that were isolated. I think dermorphin has been isolated as one of the bioactive peptides, which is very analgesic. Um, Dimorphin. Da, uh, it's called dermorphin. D oh, dermorphin. Dermorphin. I believe it attaches. I don't know if it's mu or delta opioid receptors, but it's a very potent agonist for that receptor. And I think it's some people say it's four thousand more times more potent than other opioids that we work with. But I don't know where they got that from, and I certainly can't find any research on it. So, but either way, it's 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 highly analgesic, so pain relieving. And another one, dermoceptin, I believe, has been isolated as an antibacterial agent which is highly effective against gram positive things like mrsa and other horrible nasties which are becoming rampant uh, in hospitals so there there are some companies i think there's something like 70 patents out on cambo some of the peptides oh, I'm not sure oh. what happened to them or what's what's going on with all but that. don't you think that that defeats the object of the of putting patents on single peptides now, this is a big problem with drugs Exactly. This is the thing. It's the monotherapy. It's the monocrop. When you get your whole field of crops, it's like, well, you're actually making that thing completely susceptible to disease or infestation because there's not this nice ecology or complex ecology that actually has inbuilt mechanisms to stop things from overrunning, which I experienced trying to grow any vegetables in my veg garden in London. It's just so overrun with slugs, but there was just such a lack of birds around to actually eat the slugs and I don't know it was just I could tell there was something horribly wrong it's like why are there bazillions of slugs when I went to Mexico in the mountains I'm like oh wow all well, your lettuce is so beautiful like how do you not get overrun by slugs they're like oh I think I've seen two in my life and I'm just like this is this is this is what happens in medicine as well it's like mm. have a monotherapy and then the body develops a mutation to it because it's such a simplistic thing yes. to the orchestra that is the human body, that is biology, that is the miracle mm. of life. When you come and you're trying to reduce it down to this one thing, then it's then nature's going to find a way around it. And that's why Cambo will never become mainstream because as a whole medicine, that is the magic of it. And and really, if you assume you're make money. taking it apart, then it's not going to be as effective. And, and it won't make money as, because um, it's, it's free, freely available. It's like cannabis. So, um, yeah. yeah, interesting.